This is question 10 in a series of videos taking a look at the Edexcel practice papers. Here we're asked to enlarge triangle T by a scale factor of a half, centre 2, 0. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to identify where that centre 2, 0 is. So what I can see is that that is the coordinate just there. And what I'm going to do with this coordinate is I'm going to measure the distance to each of the three corner points on my triangle. And then because it is a scale factor half, I'm going to take that distance and half it. So if I take this corner point at the bottom just there, the distance that that point is from the center, at the moment it's two to the right and four up to get from the center to that point. So two right, four up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to half that distance. So instead of going two right and four up, I'm going to go one right and two up. And that's going to give me my new bottom left corner on my, uh, on my new triangle. Then just carrying this on for the rest of the points, if I take that point up the top, I can see that that's two to the right and eight up. So instead of two to the right, I'm going to go one to the right. And instead of going eight up, I'm going to go four up to give me that point there. And then the last one, four across, four up. So two across, two up. Um, and then all that's left to do is draw this shape to give my final answer. So my final answer would look uh, like that. Uh, just, people sometimes get a little bit confused. They still use the word enlarge even if the shape has got smaller. Because it's a scale factor half, um, essentially what you're saying is that it's halving the size. And so what you can see is that this uh, length at the bottom there is uh, got a size, um, the base has got a, a length of one, but this base has got a length of two. And if we were to measure this side, you can see that that's, that length there is two and that length there is four. So the new shape, uh, despite its end and enlargement, has actually halved in size. And that's because we've got a fractional scale factor.